A Miami landmark has a new look tonight. The Intercontinental Hotel in downtown Miami just got a $30 million facelift. Wow, that's more than yours. I'm it's sexy. Way more than mine. It's sophisticated and it lights up the Miami skyline from clear across the bay. Our queen of all things sexy and clear, Shereen Sandoval, is here to tell us all about it. Shereen? I paid her Tony Yellow. <laughs> well, it just so happens the Intercontinental was where tennis great Venus Williams stayed the very first time she played in Key Biscayne as a teen. Now the former number one ranked player in the world is back, gracing the place with her Venus touch. Yo, ain't no city in the world like this, and if you ask how I know I got the this is the hot new look of downtown Miami's Intercontinental. Welcome to my the 30-year-old landmark on the bay has been reinvented to the tune of $30 million. And tennis champ Venus Williams helped serve up the new look. This renovation has been two years in the making. Um, there's been 641 rooms that have been renovated, as well as the lobby. And the inspiration for this space is really uh, Miami. Uh, in the history of Miami. Venus's company, B Star Interiors, did design work in the hotel's 2,500 square foot presidential suites and aced other areas too. So telling the story of Miami was important and right here we're in the me Metropolis suite. You think of Metropolis, you think of something you're very modern and, and the city filled with, with skyscrapers and things like that. The Venus touch is bold and sophisticated with pops of color. We use the cool colors and um, streamlined shapes, but also made it feel really, really inviting. It was just about um, really making a story that was impactful and um, making the, the guests feel comforted. For people to know that the Intercontinental is is really one of the landmarks in the skyline. You show the lights that stop me, to stop. And the landmark is now lit up with a 19-story tall dancer on an LED screen. It's a silhouette uh, of a dancer on the side of the building, and it just is one of the many things that we can do with this new technology uh, that we have. The front facade and lobby are lit up as well, but Venus left some subtle touches hidden in secret spots too. Yeah, I leave tennis balls under the bed. And if you know, you get a signed ball, has my phone number on it, you know, but uh, basically it, it was really about um, telling that story of Miami. I'm going to Miami. I don't know, Lynn, I'm kind of convinced that may be you on the side of that building. The hotel is Venus's first design job in hospitality hospitality so you can check in and out her work in person or just eat at the hotel's new Latin steakhouse Toro Toro. Its internationally renowned chef is Richard Sandoval. 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 He's from Mexico City. We may be related. Does that mean I get a free meal? 